Well, voter fraud is not a new problem. In fact, just yesterday we told you about an FBI investigation into an organization which is accused of submitting voter registration applications Yes, in the names of people who are already dead. Yeah. What yeah. is new, though, is a software program a Blacksburg company is developing. It's expected to make elections more secure and the process more transparent. Adam Ernest is working to change the way we vote on election day. When using our software, you can literally vote in an election and follow your vote into the ballot box to confirm that your vote is safely and securely stored just as you cast it. The software he's developing from his office at the Virginia Tech Corporate Research Center, Follow My Vote, is designed to make elections more transparent, more open and honest, he says, than they are right now. There really is no transparency. There is no way for an average voter to independently verify the results of an election. And I saw that as a big problem and one that we could, we could actually fix. His solution, online voting using what's called blockchain technology. It's a new way of storing data in an irreversible way. It's really a network of computers that process data transactions like votes and store them in a way that they're publicly verifiable. A voter is verified by taking a picture of himself and his ID before casting his vote to ensure he's actually registered. The voter is then given a randomly generated voting key which will be attached to his actual vote. His personal information is never public. The information is stored in a decentralized database instead of a single location. The entire system includes a digital paper trail. So if there were any sort of hacking activity going on, it would be immediately detected and we could deal with that issue right there in that moment. Ernest says the technology will make elections more secure and also more accessible. Our system is meant to work on, on your mobile phone, your laptop, your desktop computer, your tablet, whatever device that you have, you can securely cast your vote online using that device. He says it could cut the cost of holding an election with no need for costly optical scanners or voting machines. It will also cut the time it takes to see results. And you can monitor election in real time to, to literally track who is the likely winner uh, of the election. Ernest hopes to now test the software, possibly with the Student Government Association at Virginia Tech, where it can be used to showcase how the system works and what the experience is like for users.